such an excellent night for you, even though it wasn't the result the team wanted. Uh, um, what was working so well for you out there? You were such a spark on both sides of the ball. Uh, I appreciate it. I think I made a lot of defensive mistakes, which uh, definitely were costly. But um, just, be, just being aggressive, uh, I think that was the biggest thing. Um, playing fast um, and just trusting myself, I think that was the biggest thing. So uh wasn't the outcome we wanted. Uh, but, you know, we got, we got another one on, on Wednesday, and, you know, that's what we got to look forward to. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm seeing, we're, we're seeing improvement. I think, you know, today I think what was a, was a step back. Um, and I think, you know, we, we, we struggled, uh, you know, especially, um, you know, having that, that jolt, uh, and, and you know, the, the good thing about those guys, they're, they're young, um, you know, they're, they're, uh, coachable. Uh, you know, those guys are frustrated and harder on themselves today. Um, and we know we know what it was. Uh, and, you know, we just got to focus on, on getting it, you know. Those guys are young. You know, a lot of them in their first or second years. But um, thinking about this league, we got to grow fast. And we got to, um, you know, push the pace. And that's something with them, especially with their youth. You know, we got to focus on getting stops. And then once we get stops with their pace and um, – the talent uh, and athleticism, you know, playing um, on the break and, and you know, in, in transition, that's what we want to do. So, you know, we know what it was, and we're just going to hit the hit the drawing board on a uh, Wednesday. And, uh, you know, obviously three starters out, you know, for these past couple games. How tough is it when you got so many guys playing more minutes, playing bigger roles than they probably would be probably expected coming into the season? Uh, you know, how much does that play into you know the struggles you guys have had? Um, obviously, you know, when you have guys that's out, that's always tough, but, uh, I always take the approach of the next man up. Um, you know, that's what this, this league is, uh, for, for young guys and, um, you know, just, just, just players in general in this league, you're going to get opportunities and opportunities are going to present themselves. And right now with those guys out, it's opportunities for, um, you know, our younger guys, uh, to to really, uh, you know, get the ball moving in their careers. So uh, I, I don't look at that as a negative or, you know, guys playing more minutes than, you know, we originally anticipated. It's, it's about next man up, and they got to uh, grow up and um, keep pushing. I think that's what they're doing. And, and, you know, as these losses are starting to pile up, just what's your perspective as far as just the way you guys are handling it in the locker room? I know Coach always talks about that, you know, keeping yeah um uh you know we're, we're you know luckily morale is, is not down i'm not gonna say luckily morale morale isn't isn't down and you know we still have that pop uh but we got to make sure we i feel like sometimes we towed a line between um that that energy and that pop and um, lack of attention to detail. Uh, I think that's the biggest thing. And, you know, for us, you know, being young is not an excuse. Um, you know, losing is not an excuse. Uh, we, you know, we got to make sure we are focused and we are having attention to detail on the scouting reports and, on the, and, and have game plan discipline. And when we do that, that's when um, things are really going to start turning around. And we're not bad uh, at those things at all, um, but we just have to grow up and get better at them. And I think that's something that um, we're going to do, something that we got to continue to build on to hold each other accountable. Um, so, yeah. Is that, just, is, is that kind of playing too fast at times, do you think, when, when you, you're playing with that, that extra energy boost and, and sometimes maybe that's no. – no, I, I don't think it's playing too fast. I think it's not um, having – th I think part of it is the experience. 
part of it is, you know, not being able to, you know, see the whole court. And that's not, you know, just offensively, but also defensively, seeing what teams are running, seeing, um, you know, what's effective for them and, and trying to to stop that or counter that. So, um, you know, it, it part of it is being young and, you know, we got to grow up. We got to really um, dive in film wise because, you know, in the NBA season it's hard because you can't practice because you got so many games. So, I won't say you can't practice, but you have limited practice time. So you got to really dive in to film and really be a student of the game to see those things. And then when you're able to see it, you're able to communicate better on defense. You're able to um, get stops. You're able to run and play with that pace and on the offensive end. And we never, you know, we, we turn the ball over sometimes, but it's always out of, most of the times out of aggression and we, and we take, you know, some of those turnovers, but we just can't have the lack of attention to detail and lack of focus on game plan discipline um you know that you know that we're having in in some of these games to, a little bit to Jen and Will's question do you think for some of these guys the increased roles that they had to step up into because of the, the injuries and things like that are going to pay off in the next mm-hmm. you know, once once yeah. everybody gets back in there they can take a step back and then be a little bit better in the role and yeah for sure for sure um uh, you know Playing in the NBA and and getting time and getting those opportunities are only going to be beneficial to these guys and, and their careers for us and and you know hopefully all those guys have long careers and and will follow them. Um, so when you get you know B I Z uh, Herbert Jones, um, you know we get those guys back, then we're able to really see you know the team as a whole and you know the roles will be you know kind of set in stone. And guys will be able to really learn and, and do those kind of things. So, um, you know, it's growing pains for those guys. I mean, you know, we, everyone goes through it. You know, first first year or two in the league is always, you know, you kind of just wide eyed. You're just kind of just trying to to learn and be, you know, and be a sponge. And you know, for those guys getting the opportunity to do this early in his career, um, it's only going to be beneficial. Cool. Thanks, Jacob. Cool. Recording.